Okay, if you're watching on social media, we are going live on Amazon. We're just waiting for the countdown clock to count down. We've got, uh, we're using the BeLive software today uh, to do our countdown timer. So that's going to be good. We're looking at the preview on Amazon. It says go live on Amazon. We can go live on Amazon. So that's all looking good. And then while that's just counting down, that just gives me a little minute to just type in welcome some messages let's just see welcome Hello and welcome. I've got two cameras on the screen. Uh, yeah, we're going to have some fun today. Let me take that camera off and we'll have this one. Yes, welcome to the video uh, kit guide. So getting started with video. This is a kit that uh, can get you started, get you making videos, get yourself seen, get yourself found. Uh, and that's really cool. We are on Amazon. We're also on YouTube, Facebook and LinkedIn today. Thanks to my good friends at B.Live amazing third-party software that allows us to stream on Amazon and all these other locations all at the same time. Saves a lot of hassle, to be honest. Um, so that's how we can bring our audience from social media onto the Amazon platform. Now, if you're not watching on Amazon, then uh, amazon.com, then you can go over to Nick wood.live and that will take you to my amazon storefront where you can see the live stream and you can see the items in the carousel what's the carousel i hear you asked well let me show you the carousel because i'm using BeLive. i can share it with you here so this is what is in the carousel guys um so we're going to be talking about um the nexigo stream cam that's the camera that was on a minute ago we're talking about the logitech we're going to talk about the m 270 wireless uh, keyboard and mouse combo um, we're also going to be talking about the zoom certified nexigo uh, that's a really cool element there um, this is popping all the comments in <laughs> we got the ring light i maybe just need to switch that off a touch but actually what i will put last two ones otherwise you're going to get comments if you're watching on youtube and facebook you're just going to get all these comments which are the affiliate links um, so uh, i'll just carry on um, so yeah we've got the purple power i'm using right here that's the link in there um and we've got the logitech mevo start as well um but that's uh what i'm going to do today is actually i'm going to go backwards um because we, we normally start uh, uh alexa stop uh <laughs> that's alexa for you um okay let's kick off we're going to go from the back and then we'll come back to the front again because the last few shows it's been hectic and i've not been able to get them done so uh let's take that off the screen and like so hide it fantastic welcome everybody um let's put a bit more light on alexa office light on Oh, it's probably my folks i told her to stop um but in the streams at the moment we've actually got uh, let's talk about them we've got the three alexas three echo dots um we got that's the fourth gen i actually bought the fourth gen on the uh, amazon pre uh, the amazon sale so we've got the third gen echo dot we've got the fourth gen there and we've also got uh, the fourth gen with the cock built in as well so that's downstairs in the lounge fourth gen echo dot is just here and the echo dot third generation is in the bedroom basically because we need to do all these things we can control our what i love about it is we can control our environment 
uh, all by just using the Echo Dot. So we can say, Alexa, office light on. Okay. Hey, and then she puts the light on. Hallelujah. We're good to go. Now, I'm just going to double check one of my little, uh, my network, because it's looking a little bit flaky. Um, and again, in the carousel, we've got the TP-Link Deco, and that's what allows me to just run a network optimization. So I can run that on the phone. Hopefully that will optimize and we will be good to go. Um, so yeah, so in the carousel, while that's doing, um, let's talk about, first of all, we've got the chair. This is my lovely chair. I will stand up actually and show you. Uh, this is the com hom offer chair, um, $132 in the carousel. It's got a lovely mesh uh, back to it, which is lovely. Uh, arms raise up and down, nice soft seat. And it's got uh, five little rollers uh, that it has. So I'm just going to switch that light off because it's off putting me. Um, yeah, so it's got five little feet, five rollers. So it just rolls around, spins 360 degrees, lean back as well. Nice lumbar support. Now, what I absolutely love about this was it took me literally about 20 minutes to put together. It arrived. I just had to put the wheels on the bottom. It's got a, a gas canister so I can adjust the height. Uh, and then literally a um, couple of screws in the seat and a couple of screws in the back. And it even comes with its own Allen key. So, yes, that's a com hom the com homer office chair. So it really is nice. Now, next we've got is this little light here. Um, I'll actually lift it up and show it to you. This, when you video, when you, video you need some decent lighting. And this is the... Uh, Logitech Lytra Glow uh, light. It is excellent. It hangs or just sits on my Mac screen. Um, USB-C to USB cable. Uh, it's extendable. It's got a little hanger there. Um, and we can switch it on and off from the back as well. So we've got all that, all that going on. But the reason it is so good, and it's this thing with lots of Logitech uh, lights and cameras is it comes with a bit of software you've got the logitech g hub that's how we can control it uh, and so that means we can actually control it just via our desktop so because i'm using be live i'm going to share the screen so you can actually see what i mean so let's pop that in the stream share that and hopefully show you in the stream there we go Perfect. So that is the this is the software that we're using. So as I say, we can turn the light on and off just by our desktop. Now it's got these brilliant presets, but we can control the temperature, the coolness or the warmth and the brightness. And it's got some great presets. That's on cozy daylight, but we could have bright, cool blue. Uh, we could have mild afternoon. Uh, we could have soft sunset. That's nice. Um, what else can we have? Oh, cozy candlelight. And this last one is his like towering inferno. Whoa, where it's dialed up full warmth, dialed up full brightness. That's a little bit too much. Now, what I'll do, I put cozy daylight on. And what you can see in the little screen here is we can select which camera we want the light to do. So that's looking at me with the Nexigo. Uh, but also I could switch it over to my Mevo, which is the one I'm looking at now. And that, then I can then adjust the lighting for that camera. It is so, so clever. And you can set it, you can make your own presettings. But it is just a really, really clever piece of kit. That's why I wanted to share it with you uh, in the stream just now. Because lighting is so important. It is absolutely key to making great video. Right now, I'm pleased to say uh, we've got perfect score on the network. So that should be good. OK, uh, right. Next in the carousel, as we're going backwards, is the Obspot Tiny, which is a tiny pan, tilt and zoom camera. And if you go to yesterday's movie quiz show with myself and Stephen Healy, a live video production weekly, then uh, Stephen does a beautiful demonstration of that. Next up, we've got the newer RGB video light. This is so cool. Uh, this is it. And I've been using it. I'm going to take the green screen down today. So tomorrow we'll see it a little bit differently. But I've been using this to backdrop my light, my backdrop. 
um, because I've got it on a pulse here that's going to go through all the different colors. Um, but we can do presets. We can play around with it. It's uh, where have I gone? Yeah, so we've got cop car, we've got ambulance, we've got fire, we've got lightning, we've got fireworks, all these different presets, TV, candle, party mode, so we'd like a party mode. We've got all flash bulbs, uh, we've got pulsing, we've got strobes, we've got RGB strobes, that's pretty cool. Um, we've got paparazzi, so all these different flashes, emergency, headlight beam, red flash, green flash, blue flash, uh, and HSI slow, and that's where it's just gonna slide uh, into the different colors, and HSI fast. So this is 20 different settings we can have just with this one light. It's got three uh, hot shoes for the cameras. Uh, it'll sit in a nice little tripod mount, as a standard tripod mount there as well. Comes with its own little charger into a USB. Absolutely great, so always, as I say, love playing around with lighting, and that just gives it a really lovely backdrop. So we'll see that next time uh, we're on the show tomorrow or later on today. Uh, no, tomorrow because I'll leave the green screen up today, and then you'll see that, and that just beautifully gives a gives your background something a little bit more magical, a little bit more something you can hang your coat on, something that just gives you that air of professionalism and subtlety. Uh, so that's really that's a really good uh, thing. Now also. Uh, this part of the carousel we also have and because i'm using the mevo start i can actually just click on it so this is the uh the green screen as well so that's a green screen on one side blue screen on the other um which is really is a lovely thing i do like my green screens i do like playing around with green screens dropping in uh different backgrounds it makes life so much fun now Okay, so we did the echo dots. Let's pull back. Actually, I'll tell you, on our way back up through the carousel, um, I do want to show you this. This is great. This is the, uh, uh, what's it called? The Life Pro Under the Desk uh, Peddler. So I'm going to share it on the screen with you. So I'm just going to click it. Again, guys, this is why I love using BeLive, because we can do all these things. We can share on screen. We can have multiple cameras, uh, which is what I also love. It's just so cool. And if you're an Amazon uh, live stream influencer watching, then seriously, guys, you really do want to get this bit of kit uh, because it is designed uh, to work on Amazon. So we can pull people's comments in, show people our products. And so now I can uh, take that one out. Where's it gone? There we go. Showing screen. So, yeah, this is it. I'll put myself down in the bottom. So this is the Life Pro, and I've sold a few of these, Life Pro under the desk elliptical uh, pedal exerciser to strengthen muscles. So you build your cardiovascular fitness um, and you know while you're doing your videos or while you're working at a desk, uh, this is really cool. So um, boost your heart rate, gain endurance, improve flexibility and circulation, increase uh, muscle bone density. That's how we do it. Burn calories, build strength while sitting. It's got eight tension levels, warm up, light cardio, endurance training and muscle toning all while you're sitting at your desk. It is absolutely cool. And like I say, sold a few of these. They're obviously going like hotcakes. Not least because I think there's a nice little discount on there. Um, yeah, we've got a nice little 6% off right now. 159.99. So uh, yeah, nice little bargain into the bar. Yeah, nice little bargain that you can get. But you didn't come here for pedal power. You came here. Let me take it off. You came here for video cameras. And the one I'm looking at, uh, one I'm using rather right now is the one I'm going to talk about, and it is the Mevo Start. I'm just going to find it in the carousel. Here we go. Yeah, this is it. This is the Mevo Start camera. Oh, oh my goodness! I absolutely love this camera. It is so cool. It's the one I'm looking at you right, looking at right now. Okay, it is not just a live stream camera. It is a wireless live stream camera. It is connected to nothing other than my home network and that's it it's got a six hour battery life which is fantastic it's got a f 2.8 sony lens which is beautiful because it's got a uh, distortion uh, equaling it's got a processor it's got a three mem, mem microphone array for well spatial array for beautiful crisp audio um it's also at the back 
uh, as you can't see the back on this picture, but at the back, um, it's got the on off button, but also it's got a 3.5 mil jack. So I could actually plug my lapel mic directly into the back of the Amiibo start. Also, it's uh, got a USB-C to USB cable that will charge it up, but also it will be a wired webcam as well. So we can just have a wired webcam. Amazing. But what I love, because this is a, we want it for wireless live streaming. And so we're out and about, we're live streaming, maybe we're live streaming our church services, maybe we're live streaming our kids' little league games, maybe softball, maybe basketball, maybe soccer, football, graduation ceremonies, you name it, uh, we can live stream it. And But what might happen is, you know, if you're all at the same place live streaming at the same time, then, you know, we might be pinging the cell same tower because we can use a cell phone data or we can use our Wi-Fi hotspot data uh, or our Wi-Fi hotspot. So we're always going to be trying to get each other's bitrate. Um, but we're OK, because if that ever happens and you lose your live stream for any reason, that's, you know, we are at the mercy of these things. What this camera does, because I've got a 128 gigabyte SD card in the back, doesn't come with it, so you have to buy one, scan disk, awesome. Then I can actually record 14 hours of the live stream in 1080 high definition. So that's right, we've got high definition camera that we can live stream and also record. So whatever happens to the live stream, you have got a beautiful high definition recording because it's being recorded direct from the camera. Now, I know what you're saying, Nick, but I can live stream on my, I can just live stream on my phone. And you can. It's true. And let me hide that for a minute. That is true. But what you can't do on your phone that you can do on the Mevo start is you can live stream to YouTube, Facebook, Twitter, Twitch, LinkedIn, Vimeo, Oh, and anywhere else you might want to live stream to because it's got RTMP, real time messaging protocol. And what that does is it allows us to live stream. I could live stream using it to go to Amazon. I could live stream to my website. I know a lot of people aren't so fussed on social media these days. And there's a lot of people with family blogs that's simple to create. So we could actually live stream to a family blog. So amazing, you know. It doesn't matter. And then you can actually have it sat there as a recording as well. So you've got all this potential. It is just amazing. Now, you can also get a packet of three um, because I, no, I would have done that myself. Had I known it was so good initially, I would have got the three pack because there's a bigger discount on the three pack. So while this one in the carousel is three, six, seven, um, what we do have is in the in the in the carousel, you've got a three pack for about nine, nine, seventy or nine seventy seven. If I'd known that, I would have got that, particularly for the cooking show. And speaking of cooking, hello, Cookbook Divas. Yay. Great to see you again. Fantastic. Oh, we've got a lovely, we've got a lovely comment there. That has a six hour battery. That's cool. Possibly to get a dummy battery for it. Not I'd ever do a live stream more than two hours. My voice would die. <laughs> no, I'll tell you what, uh, this is true. The six hour battery is brilliant. Now you can get a power pack as well. So you can't, it's not a removable battery, it's built in. Um, but as I say, yeah, at six hours, you're pretty gonna, you know, you're pretty much gonna cover yourself. It charges fairly quickly as well. Takes a from empty takes two or three hours, I think, to to charge up fully. Um, but yeah, it's really good. And I can guarantee you that is a genuine six hours because I've done that so many times. I using it for Amazon live streaming. So I just let it run down because I know that's good for battery life. And cookbook dealers, I've got a bit I want to share your comment because it's so cool because I've got the cook show tomorrow. I've been putting it off, but now I've managed to get it all together and quick plug tomorrow on Amazon and Facebook and YouTube. Uh, we've got the Keto Nick cooking show where I'm going to be cooking um, pumpkin soup. I grew my own pumpkin in the summer from a little tiny weed to a big, lovely pumpkin. In fact, I've got a picture of it. I'll show you there. That's the fella. So that little, uh, that little cherub is coming on, um, but it's at a different time. So this will be at 1 p.m. Eastern. Uh, that's 6 p.m. in the UK. Pumpkin soup. If you want to cook along, it won't take long. All you need is pumpkin, heavy cream or double cream if you're in the UK, butter, 
pumpkin, double cream, oh, uh, stock, either chicken or vegetable if you want to be vegetarian, and salt and pepper to taste. That's it. It's a super, super simple recipe, but it tastes divine. And we might just pop a little bit of Parmesan in, Parmesan cheese on the top, maybe, just to give it a little zhuzhi. Um, but yeah, so it's um, keto friendly. Uh, so that's with the keto Nick brand. If people who don't know, yay, perfect, perfect. Well done, you're vegetarian. This is what we like to see. Um, and so, so yeah, so it's uh, it's great. So you can use a beautiful vegetable stock, and it'll be delicious. It is. I love pumpkin soup. Um, and if I can get my head around it, depending on how much pumpkin I've got, we might do pumpkin pie. But we probably won't have time for that. So I'll have to do that recorded and drop it in the. Uh, on the Facebook page, but uh, but yeah, no, that'd be lovely if you could join. That would be superb, and that's going to be every Wednesday. I say one p.m. Eastern, six p.m. in the UK. Ketonic cooking show live on Amazon. We got all the we got the kitchen kit to play around with. Um, you know, I'm a I do like my kitchen gadgets, but Nutri Ninjas, uh, Kitchen Aid, and other bits and pieces. Okay, right. Uh, where was he? Oh yes, no. So told you a bit about the camera. How do we control it? Well, this is the nice thing. We control it from this brilliant little app. I'm going to take the pumpkin off. And what I want to do is just share with you and show you how this app works. So hopefully I'm going to be able to do that by sharing my screen again. And this is the brilliance of BeLive, guys, because I'm actually going to share with you my uh, phone screen. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. I'd like a challenge. Um, so, right, that's just going through. We say, yep, look to live. Let's share the screen. Come on, baby. Don't let me down now. Oh, it's mirroring. Fantastic. Right, so I can share my phone screen. Let's do that. And then you can see absolutely what's in the app. Fantastic. Oh, this is so good. So cool. I love this. In the stream, come on. Now, what might happen, it might echo a touch. No, that's right. That has worked. Cool. Um, so sometimes when I flip it on, uh, it you can hear it uh, starts it. Right. So this is the app in the in the uh, in the phone. So as you can see, uh, we've got a big, nice uh, 86 degree diagonal uh, point of view, um, which is awesome. Um, and that looks like that, if you're me. Um, okay, so, but nicely, we can just press my face, bang, and we're in there. So if I wanted to have a look at the green screen on the side, maybe I want to look at the little newer uh, light at the bottom there, um, but we've got all that field of vision that we can play with. So that gives us lots of um, options. Now, also, this is what I love, look, we can have, and I've still got it from the Prime Day. But I need to delete a load of these. Every time you make one, it makes another one. So I've got all these timer countdown timers. But if I wanted a countdown timer, I could put it on, and I could just have it in the corner, as you can see. Um, or, indeed, I could have it on the other corner, like that. Uh, or I could actually have it in the full screen like that counting down so we've got all these brilliant options and the other thing i like about it you get the time back again is you've got a little timer element here and we can either set it to a specific start time or a certain amount of time so if you're going to live stream for example i can live stream well probably will do it tomorrow i will live stream the cooking show tomorrow i'll put the timer on so i'll set it for 1 p.m eastern or 6 p.m uk and that way, whenever I actually set up the Mevo and press start, that will come up uh, and it will be good to go. And it will just count down to the time we start. So, so clever. I really do love it. Uh, right, let's turn it off. Um, also, we have here, just to go through a little few bits. Hey, Joseph De La Cruz. Thank you so much for following. Guys, yeah, if you're watching on Amazon, please do hit that uh, lovely little follow button. Um, I don't think you get any... Uh, well, I know you don't get any spammy emails every time I go live. I think all that happens uh, is my stream gets put in another part of the Amazon ecosystem. So you might be able to find me 
just uh, just knocking around. So, um, yeah. So thank you very much for the follow. I really do appreciate that. Okay, so what we have here, uh, this is how we manage it. So we've got on the A here, press the A, um, that's the camera assistant. So it finds faces. Uh, it also has um, live follow. So uh, hopefully that will follow me now. So you can see it's uh, the camera is tracking me. And that is so cool because that's always going to keep me uh, in the right place. So I've got a little bit of lag going at the moment, not to worry. Um, Let's switch that off because that is a little bit off-putting when I'm trying to demonstrate. Uh, so take that off. Um, yeah, so we have that element. We've got access to our microphones. And I say we can put the lapel mic in. Um, we can play music. Uh, we can do all sorts uh, with that. Uh, and here we have all our filters. So we've got filters for lighting. We've got other filters that we can use all over preset filters uh, and also we've got all our white balance our exposure uh, everything that you can think of so i'm just going to put it back to normal that'll do me um yeah we've got so much control and then finally let me share with you this element so this is where the nuts and bolts are um, it comes with a 28 day free trial of Vime, vimeo producer um to be honest after the 28 days i just bought the annual subscription works out at $15 a month. That's what allows us to go to all the different um, places using that RTMP as well. And that we can actually upload our high definition video directly to Vimeo as well. And then you can use Vimeo as you can actually embed that in your blog. Uh, what else we've we got here is we've got the live stream, we've got audio, video settings, app settings. Uh, we've got NDI. So we can use NDI, and that's really good, especially if you've got the three cameras. Um, and we also say we can enable HEVC. Um, if you change the NDI settings, we've got the wired webcam mode that's in beta. That works well. And you've got studio mode if you've got the pro version, I think, of, um, of Vimeo. But uh, yeah, it is absolutely the most amazing camera. I absolutely love it. I'm going to stop sharing my screen. So let's hide that or remove it rather. As removed, and let me just uh, stop sharing it on my phone. Well, that'll run out. Perfect. There we go, and all back. And that is it. That's the Mevo Start. It is just absolutely the best camera I have ever used for live streaming. Um, uh, along with it, um, so these things are often bought with it in the carousel. We've got the um, the small little clamp. So imagine if you're out and about and you're um, you're wanting to live stream like your kids baseball game something like that then you can clamp it on excuse me you can clamp it onto fences um, and you can get all the angles you want um, it also you've got the mevo floor stand as well um, so that's always handy to have it's got a uh, i didn't show you but it's got a it's a standard tripod mounting you just screw it into a tripod mount i'm screwing it into my newer uh, box light stand right now but also you can unscrew the little attachment and that then is a microphone stand a standard as um standard connection as well so you screw it into a microphone stand so you've got all these uh, different options which is so cool um and then also one last one that's often sold with it um and not surprisingly it's the cover so it's a logitech mevo start cover case um and that's nice it's um protective zippered soft case um and again that's in the carousel because you know why would you spend lots of money on a camera and not want a lovely case to go with it it is really i mean seriously guys um if you've used one before uh, this is so good now it's come out of now logitech have bought them over it is just unbelievable will they update again i don't know um they used to update every two years and so this one is probably going to come with an update, but uh, I'm not sure what else they can uh, they can really do. There's no point. We're looking at the 4K. Uh, the previous version had a 4K camera on it, but the thing is, when you've got that big wide screen on the 4K, if you're then narrowing it down, you're losing 4K anyway, so it doesn't really make any difference. So, no 1080 high definition. It's the way to go. Uh, and if also, if you have a video yourself in 4K, you want a bit of um, makeup. <laughs> 
or I do at least. <laughs> so it's a, it's a fantastic camera and uh, I'm mighty glad I got it. Um, yeah, full disclosure, guys, I bought it. It wasn't sent to me. Uh, I wanted it. I wanted the camera, uh, not least because I wanted to trial it because I thought it was excellent. Um, but also I wanted it because I wanted to do the cooking show, which I've uh, said is on its way. So that's cool. Right. So let's have a look next in the carousel. Let's stick with cameras. We'll go right to the front now. And let's have a little look at the Nexigo Stream Cam N930E. Uh, this is a lovely little camera and I'm going to share it on the screen as well. And this is the great thing, guys, about using BeLive is that we can do both at the same time. So I've got this camera. I just like, bing, there we go. So it's obviously a little bit nearer. Um, but also we've got a little bit of software on that. So let me, uh, what I'm going to do, I'm going to hide myself down in a corner. And so now you're looking at me on the next you go. So I'll sit back a bit because the next you go is a little bit nearer than me. Um, but you're still hearing me through the purple panda, uh, the Valier lapel mic also in the carousel. Now this next you go camera is lovely. It's because it also has the standard uh, mount for a tripod. That's really important because you like the tripods to be, uh, we like the cameras to be nice and secure when we're videoing. Um, but also we can sit here and this one is sitting just happily on the on the desk, on the, uh, sorry, on the display. Um, it can rotate 360 degrees uh, and it also has a built-in microphone as well. So I'm gonna demonstrate the built-in microphone um, because it's a noise cancelling microphone. So all I need to do is actually make sure I've got it correct in that one. Okay, and then I'm just going to turn the microphone off here. Unmute that one. And now um, you should be able to hear a difference. Um, this is not the best, or this is not the most audio friendly room I'm broadcasting in. A uh, very plain brick wall just behind the uh, iMac that I'm sitting in front of. So just behind the camera and the microphone is a brick wall. There's not a great deal around me. It's going to absorb the sound, but it's a, that is the the sound you are now hearing is from the Nexigo uh, live stream uh, camera or stream cam in 930. So I'm going to switch over again. So we are back to the uh, lapel mic. Um, so that has a great microphone. But the thing I really love about it, it's got a three setting ring light. So you can look, I'm pretty well lit already. But if I press it once, oops, one, two, come on, and three. That's it. So we've got a three setting. Uh, ring light that has even more brightened my face. And so this is what's important. That's what I love about it is that if you're streaming uh, or recording video, you're going to be well lit. And that's really important. So you want the you want light on your face so you get rid of all those shadows. But then also, you know, you think about it. If you're even if you're not live streaming or not creating video, maybe you're just using it as a stream camera just for your zoom calls or your team meetings or your google hangouts and we've all been there you know we've been to group meetings and we've seen the people you know on the zoom calls and it's really dark and dingy because they're using their back bedroom and they've got no decent lighting in it and um, they've got a fake zoom background trying desperately to to come through but there's not enough light uh, in order to do it and so this is awesome because it's going to light you up you will look the best on the meeting and when you're well lit you know, you're going to look like the person that knows what they're doing. It is so true. And so when it comes to promotion time, to pay rise time, you're going to be looking head and shoulders above your colleagues. And, you know, it's a dog eat dog world out there. Um, so this is just another thing that just gives you an extra uh, little bit of je ne sais quoi, I think we like to call it. But yeah, this is a great, an entry level webcam shoots in 1080 high definition. It also comes with some great software. Um, in fact, I can share with you that software as well. I'm doing good on sharing today. Uh, let me share that. Go to the screen and share. Which one is it? That one there. 
and show it in the screen. Come on. Yeah, so here we got the uh, the software, the Nexigo software that we can share. So we've got control of the brightness, the contrast, uh, the hue, saturation, sharpness, um, the gamma. So if I did brightness, let you see. So you've got all that control, contrast, uh, hue, change it around, find something we like. Uh, and then you've got advanced where you can actually play around with the exposure. This will be a horrible look. Whoa, a bit overexposed there. Um, you can have an auto exposure or we just play around with the exposure so we're not blasted out. Uh, that's good. That's very nice. Um, yeah, I think I'll stick with that. And look, see, we can save. Uh, we can have a preset and we can save it. So uh, it is all good. And you've got a preview as well. A preview. Oh, that comes up with another another window that you couldn't see but yeah so that's whoa what's going on? <laughs> just i've just really mucked it up uh let's switch around that way that's better so yeah look. <laughs> oh i love it when a demo goes well cool so that was the next ago stream cam so i know we'll switch that off um which was excellent so yes yeah, so for an entry level and my goodness guys look in the carousel right now it is 40% off 47.99 that is an absolute bargain so 47 48 bucks guys uh for an entry level stream cam built in microphone with noise cancellation software that uh, is epic um okay so let's have a think about what we can do and next right i'm actually having just switched that camera off i actually do want it switched on so to show uh i might need it to show you another camera but next in the carousel, we, let's get this one, is the Logitech C920. And again, oh, this has got a great discount on it as well. My goodness, these cameras have got amazing discounts. 16% off, $67 uh, for this C920. Now, these are great. This was like the go-to camera we had um, a few years ago. We all went out and bought one because... I'm just trying to find it. Sorry, I'm just trying to find it in the carousel. Just to make sure I'm telling you the right things. Yeah. So, yeah, so this is, again, a brilliant camera. Uh, Logitech Webcam C920S HD Pro with privacy shutter. Um, a 1080 streaming web widescreen video camera built in microphone for recording. It is such a good little camera. And again, just like the Nexigo, uh, it comes with the... Uh, ability to just screw it into a tripod so it's going to be rock solid um, but also we have the ability to open it up and sit it on a on a laptop or a pc but on the display so or i'm trying to think of the other word for the display the monitor that's the word um, so that will sit there like that and you can just have it nicely at um at eye height because it's important that we look into the camera um yeah so it's a widescreen camera so we've got widescreen we can then cut it into smaller and what i want to show you hopefully this will work what i want to try and show you is how it might work oh i just realized i think what happened that switched over to the wrong camera that's why no, no, maybe not. Yeah, right. Let me try, try and find the C920. Come on, baby. Uh, right, let me unplug the... Unplug the Nexigo. And we've got the C920 in here. Unplug it, plug it in. Hopefully that will allow us to use that camera. Let's switch that off. Right, let's... Fingers crossed, guys. Let's bring this camera in. And pick the right one. Come on. Oh, that's annoying. Oh well, it might work because I've got it on Logi Capture. Let's have a let's have a little look. Let's see. This might work. What I need to do, and again, this is with the C920. That's why I'm hoping it works. If I turn Logi Capture on, it might click in. Uh, this is the thing when you've got more than one camera attached to <laughs> attached to uh, attached to software then you can get these little conflicts which happen 
but uh, let me just try this. So it comes with, like all Logitech cameras, it comes with, um, or it doesn't come with, but you can uh, download uh, some software called Logi Capture. And what Logi Capture allows you to do is actually to record and have some, you know, and, and make some great video because it allows you to actually record presentations, um, uh, use chroma key. So we've got the green screen. So that's what I'm going to try and show you just while we're waiting for the Logi uh, Capture to come on. And yes, thank goodness that works. So let me just hit the reset. And uh, actually, this is good because it'll give us a chance to play around and see. see. So, so we bring, bring on, on the screen. screen. And as, as you can, can see, see. Um, um, so, so we've got, got the Mevo start. start. On one side, and we've got, got the Logi capture, capture, so that's, that's not looking, looking as, uh, as, as nice. nice. So, so let's, let's try and go into the... Into the... Da, 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 da. Oh, oh, I want you to know, I want to show you the... Let me share with you... The actual software and that way you're going to see it better that's, that's what, what i'm trying to do, to do. sorry i'm looking about uh that one there okay and my apologizes if there was some echo just then uh my fault because i Right, is that going to play ball? Yes, hallelujah. Right, so now you're looking at, this is the software, okay, um, that we can use. So obviously we've got frame rate or exposure. We can decide which one's more appropriate. Um, now we can play around with settings to make it look a little bit better. So let's keep autofocus on. Uh, we've got auto white balance, but we can, we can play around with that. Uh, okay, these for some reason aren't working so well. But what I wanted to show you was this. We can zoom in. And when we zoom in, uh, oops, okay, that way. We can zoom in again, come back that way, and we get the. What I'm trying to do is get the green screen. A bit more. So I want the green screen covering me. That's perfect. So we've got the green screen behind. This is the really clever bit. We've got chroma key. Boom. And uh, there we go. The background has gone. So if I select a second source like this, and uh, maybe I have a uh, hmm, what can we put in there? Why don't we go in with, uh, let's put that in. That's the second source. So now I can be camera in camera. Uh, if I come down to touch, there we go. So now I can be talking about the light source, the Logitech, or rather that way rather, um, and explaining with the presentation in the background. And that's like a really clever, little thing now because you can do that i'm going to switch it all off let's turn that off that's what i wanted to show you um was because we can do that um because we can do that you can actually then create your own courses so you can create your own presentations your own courses so so simply uh, and again if you've got a little let's pause with it again if you've got a, a little microphone as well then, you know, it's super, super simple. Do something, teach what you know, create a little course, sell it for seven bucks a go. Great little side hustle. And who knows, you might sell even more. Um, but yeah, no, it's a really great, really great piece of kit. 
Oh, my second light is my second light is dying. Um, okay, right. What's next in the carousel? Right now, often bought with the Logitech. So that's the Logitech C920. Say really nice. Um, also bought with it often is the MK270 wireless keyboard and mouse combo. Uh, that's particularly good for Windows. Um, also, the next you go, guys. Um, if you saw yesterday's show with Stephen Healy, the uh, the amazing. Let's just move that way. Oops. There, okay. Um, the amazing movie quiz show where we answered questions on the Godfather trilogy. We weren't sure what's going on, um, but you got this um, in the carousel, and Stephen did a great demonstration of it. This is the Nexigo 970p 4K uh, webcam, um, which is just you know a stellar, stellar thing. And that's got a 20% off now as well, which is really cool. Right next in the carousel, we got the ring light that I'm using. Uh, just now i can't actually show you that it's really frustrating uh, but the ring light just there uh that's great because um we can have our phone set on it it's got th three different color settings uh so like a warm and a normal and a cooler uh, and we can brighten it or reduce it as we will now because i've actually got the um, light to glow light on as well. Um, it's not making a huge a lot of difference because I've got too much, too light. Well, I've got three lights on, so, uh, and I'm not going to turn the lights on. Right, next in the carousel, we love it. Next in the carousel is we're looking lapel microphones. Now, uh, this was a great one, or is a great one rather. Um, uh, and this is the Movo LV1 USB Lavalier microphone. It is got a lovely, it's got a nice 20 foot long cable. It has its battery control, so be careful to switch it on and off. Um, but the nice thing is, um, battery is included. Um, there you go, that's an LR44, I believe. And that is included, so it's nothing like getting a Christmas present and there's no batteries, you can't play with it. But there, absolutely. Um, here's a little microphone, whoops. You've got um, a couple of spare clips, and again, that clips just like the one I've got on. Uh, just clips nicely uh, onto my shirt there. Uh, and it also came with a USB-C uh, 3.5 mil jack adapter. So that is how I've got the um, the Pell mic that I've got now uh, in the back of the Mac. So that's where the sound is coming from. And that's the one I want to talk to you about right now. And that is this one here. This is the Purple Panda. Uh, Lavalier, I think it's called Lavalier. I'm never sure I pronounce that word right. Lavalier lapel microphone. Um, this is what I'm using, so you can hear how awesome the sound is, and it really is great sound. Uh, but this was a kit, so it's more than just uh, the microphone. So this is a bit of a kit, and the reason I got it was because I wanted to pair it with my GoPro Hero 4. Um, and the reason I could pair it, or compare it, or just pair it, uh, is because it's got some extra bits and pieces. Now, what I love, just switch something off that's in the background. That's it. Now, what I love is the fact that it already comes with just under five feet of cable when you plug it in, first of all, which is great. Because sometimes you don't want a huge, huge, long uh, cable. You can get away with just under five feet, which I do right now, which is perfect. Um, but also, you've got another extension cable, which is just a smidge under 10 feet. So effectively, you've got pretty much, give or take an inch, 15 feet of additional cable, which is great. Now, that's really important, probably, if you're a biker, because what I did find out, having read the reviews, is this is very popular with the biking fraternity. The bikers who vlog, uh, this is their microphone of choice, turns out. Um, not least because it's also got a dead cat. What? A dead cat? No, 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 not a real dead cat. That is what we affectionately refer to as a fluffy windshield, one of these. So we pop the fluffy windshield onto our lapel mic like that. Or if you're a vlogging biker, uh, you put it on your lapel mic. And actually, you put the lapel mic up in your crash hat or your helmet. And then you've got great audio. Uh, probably, I think they probably normally, I think they probably use a GoPro stuck on the bike. Then you've got great audio and visual to go with it. And the nice thing is apparently you get great audio, but you can also hear the roar, the gentle roar of the bike engine. 
as well. So that's really neat. And I say, uh, crazily, when we're looking at reviews, one person complained it wasn't purple enough. I mean, really? <laughs> it's, uh, yeah, not purple enough. If things aren't purple enough, do you know what I like to do? Alexa, office light purple. Okay. We bring the purple vibe with us for our purple panda microphone kit. But anyway, I was telling you the reason I'm really one of the one of the big reasons, not the only reason. One of the reasons I bought it was because I wanted this little extra element that I could use for recording with the GoPro Hero 4. Now I've had this for six years, and if you know, and it's when you think this is six years old, and it even those days, even then. This is a 4K ultra high definition camera. Amazing with a wide screen. So yeah, brilliant little cameras, but what it struggled with was audio. And so you really do need to have a lapel or a microphone plugged in. So this came with a little adapter. So super, super simple to use. We just plug it in there like that. Uh, this is a 3.5 mil jack, so I just plugged in the lapel mic, and I was able to go and record uh, 4K video with great audio, all at the same time, on the same contraption. Why is that important? Well, because it makes life so much easier. <laughs> it really does. Now, uh, a couple of things we've got. I'm not sure if it's in the carousel. I, it's not there. I need to put my scan disk... Um, my Scandisk SD card in the carousel because Scandisk make great SD cards. We've got one in the Movo start uh, and also got the other one in the GoPro. But what I can do is show you uh, in the stream. This is the, I'll put myself down there. So this was up in uh, Giggly Reservoir. Uh, Giggly, I know, so funny. Giggly Reservoir up in West Yorkshire, up in the mountainous region of England. Well, when we say mountainous, uh, to most people it's just a bit hilly, but to us in England it's like a mountain. Um, so it's up high, it's windy, and I just recorded myself on. So this is a little recording testing the Purple Panda mic with the GoPro 4 and to see what it would sound like. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to switcheroo and I'm going to mute myself and uh, play and so you can hear it. Okay this is take two of Digley Reservoir trying to find out whether our sound is okay being picked up on the GoPro Hero 4 with the Purple Panda microphone kit that actually plugs into the GoPro. I don't think I had it plugged in properly earlier, but this one should work. You can see it's very beautiful up here, up in Yorkshire. And that's a reservoir down below. These are some trees and that is the path we are about to embark on. And up here is, you might be able to see some little lambs, which is always very pleasant. Okay, so let's hope this has done a good job. And as you could hear, hopefully, it did a brilliant job. Um, and that was just with this uh, little microphone cover here, not with the uh, fluffy windshield. So if I put the fluffy windshield on and, you know, been a bit more sensible, would have been perfect. Um, but yeah, so that's a brilliant thing in the carousel. Um, and look, the reason we focus on audio as well as video is that what happens, and it's true here of, of Amazon, it's a very good example. So if you're watching on Amazon, thank you very much. Please do hit that follow button. That'd be amazing, um, just like Joseph did earlier on. But if you're watching on Amazon, then you know we've got the products in the carousel. And what will typically happen is you'll click the product in the carousel, and that will take you to the product page. And you're still listening to me um, because it's just gone to a different page. So you've still got my audio. Uh, you can hear me talking about the product while you're skimming that page as well. And top tip for anyone who's into manifesting, Okay, so you've got something here you want to manifest, ideally, the Mevo Start. Pop it in your cart. Okay, don't have to buy it just yet. Just pop it in your cart 
and then wait. And then at some stage, who knows, the manifestation will occur and happen. And that's, you know, that's how we manifest. It's brilliant. Uh, okay, so up next in the carousel, oh, we're running a bit out of time. Okay, so uh, behind me, this is the tea stand. Um, again, another great bargain, 15% off the EMART T-shape uh, stand. So I'm going to Let's see. Oops, I had a little glitch on the internet there for some weird reason. Let's uh, shall we run a quick check again? A deco, I think it's okay. That is, oh no, it's okay. Yeah, that's fine. Um, yeah, so we had a little internet glitch there. Um, just lost it. So yeah, Samsung Galaxy S twenty two. Again, go back to yesterday's show, the uh, movie quiz. Stephen Healy talks about the galaxy. It's great. Uh, shoots in 8K. Scary. Um, yeah, next up here, we've got the SD card that's in the back of the Mevo Start. I say we've got that uh, Arcanite. Um, as well, um, we've got the Anchor 4 USB uh, adapter, which is really cool. Now, this is also, can't do the show without telling you about this. This is the tp link deco in the carousel this is so important and because it's white it's going to play around with my settings <laughs> um but what is so good about it is that uh, it's a hybrid mesh um wi-fi system so you can get up to six thousand square feet of coverage and what happens is if you have um uh, what's the word i'm looking for if you have wi-fi um Dead, dead zones in your house, then this is the solution. I wanted to do the cooking show. This is why it's been so delayed. I wanted to do the cooking show, um, but I wasn't able to because in the kitchen, I had no Wi-Fi. Um, I've got the router. I live in a lovely uh, house in the UK, brick built walls, router in the lounge, kitchen obviously in a different room and couldn't get the Wi-Fi through the brick walls. Same for the dining room as well. Always struggling unless I was in that one room. This is a solution, so, so clever. Um, it comes as a pack of three, and literally all you do is you take your first one, um, and it comes with an ethernet cable as well. So basically switch off your Wi-Fi router that you've got at home, um, plug in this and connect the ethernet cable to either one of these ports, I don't think it matters which one, to your wireless uh, router, switch them both on, bang, hey presto, you're gonna get a little bit of flashing light, and then suddenly, It'll form its own wireless network, totally secure. Then all you have to do is just plug in the other two. As you see in this one, there is no other cable. That's the power cable. There's no other cable, just that. Um, and so what happens is you just literally plug them in. They do a little flashing uh, on the top. Then it will go solid and it will just find itself on that network. And so basically, did I put one in the kitchen, one up here in the office, and now I get beautiful, high-speed broadband wireless broadband um, at home in any room that I have. That is the power of these. And it, they look aesthetically pleasing as well. So they don't look out of place. They look quite nice. Um, yeah, so really, really quite amazing. And if I moved, if I needed a bigger house and I had the same problem, I need another one, literally just buy one more, plug it in, and it will just form another network. Amazing. I can actually run 100 devices without any issues from this network. Um, it's got full control, full parental control. You can assign managers as well. So if you have kids, you worry about your, your kids accessing the internet, full parental control. Absolutely fantastic. Uh, okay, right. Next up is, oh, we've got the, say, yeah, we've got video. Uh, you want a, um, an external hard drive. Um, I can save the videos up to the cloud, yes. But what I really want is to be able to access them as and when I want them. And potentially, then I might not get cloud coverage, particularly if you move about. If you're an international traveler, then uh, a belt and braces job, because you know there are places that do not have uh, as good internet as you want, and maybe sometimes no internet at all, and then you cannot download from the cloud. So uh, this one's the Seagate 4 terabyte. 
um, backup, uh, but I need to upgrade to about a 20 terabyte one uh, very soon. Um, but that's really great, particularly not just for uh, videos, because videos are getting bigger and bigger files. You know, we can do standard definition in 1080 high definition, 4K ultra high definition, do 5K on the GoPro 10, and then we've got 8K now on the Samsung S22. I mean, these files are getting enormous, so we need to put them somewhere. Um, right, we also have here, oh, we've got the little lights. I need to charge it up. Um, you can see one here, though. Ah, oh, that's still bright. That's good. These are the little newer dimmable uh, light bulbs. Um, and again, we can use those for, uh, we've got the white diffusers on there, but you've got yellow, blue, red diffusers just to change your lighting around. Um, got the earfun wireless earbuds. They're in the carousel. Again, triple award-winning earbuds, guys. So comfy. Um, but CNN, on the, their latest award, said that these were a match for any of their more illustrious uh, competitors, shall we say. The sound is awesome, noise cancelling, bass boosting, uh, Bluetooth, brilliant. In fact, if you if they're totally uh, drained with no power, a 10 minute charge will give you two hours of playtime. Absolutely brilliant. Uh, I'll talk about them a bit later on. Uh, next in the carousel, we've got the newer um, kit so that so that's the uh, green screen there we've got two box lights two umbrella lights um and yeah we've got green screen we've got a black one i've got sitting here and a white cloth as well it's really cool and lots of clamps and a big frame as well so we've got the t-shaped one i'm using there but there's also the big big frame that uh, we've used before uh also in the carousel we've got the blue yeti uh, that's great i'll talk about that in a minute uh, but what i need to talk about before we go two quick items here and that is the deal of the century, um, we have 12% off the Apple iPhone 12 Pro. And that is this. Um, uh, what can I tell you? That is just an amazing, amazing deal. Um, this is brilliant. This was the first iPhone, uh, well, the first iPhone to have not just optical zoom, but also uh, telephoto zoom. So, sorry, not just digital zoom, but also uh, telephoto. Not just start again. Not just digital zoom, but also uh, optical zoom. So we've got the telephoto lenses two times in, two times out, four times optical zoom, ten times digital zoom. It's got an AI bionic chip which allows us for crisping. It will we can edit all our stuff in RAW. Um, go into settings, camera, camera settings, and switch that on. Not many people know that. Um, it's got a shoots in 4K ultra high definition. It's got a brilliant slow mo settings. Shoots amazingly in low light. We've got lidar. That's a Apple's low light detection system. Amazing shots in low light. It's got a battery that is super fast to charge. Uh, one of the other things. Oh, it's got a super super uh, high resolution screen as well. So when we're doing our Amazon Prime videos, we're streaming them on our phone. In, the, in high definition, we get a high definition screen so we can see them in all their glory. So that's really cool. Um, next in the carousel is this. Oh, I love this. I don't just love this because it's a mini projector. I love it because it's a Juan pad. And this was good. I bought this last year. Um, for my, I needed it for my parents' uh, wedding anniversary because we made a lovely little uh, video montage uh, of the family. Well, actually, their photos of their wedding, their 60th wedding anniversary, we had photos of their wedding. And of course, we got photos of all the siblings and uh, the nieces and the nephews and all that. And so this was so, so cool. Um, it's brilliant. Fantastic mini projector. But the amazing thing is they've gone and upgraded it. Um, so they've upgraded it. It's amazing. 27% off, so $79.99. Um, but it's got Bluetooth, full, eight, full HD 1080p, which I had before. Um, but they've made it 50% brighter um, images uh, and 50% clearer images. I mean, it's hard to, hard to say that they could make it 50% brighter. Um, it's got great dual speakers on the back as well. Um, I'll talk a little bit about that in the show later on. I'm back, guys, at uh, 1 p.m. Eastern. Uh, no, midday Eastern, 
sorry, uh, 5 p.m. in the UK. So I'll talk about that as well. The light bulbs that we heard, Alexa, office light white. Alexa, office light white. Okay. She gets there in the end. Um, these are the Tapo uh, bulbs. They are superb, great fun. I know kids love them, uh, parents love them. Again, it goes back to that control. We've got that control over all our energy costs. We've got the Holy Stone drone, which is there. Um, we've got the Life Pro products we mentioned earlier. We've got the thing is, I think that is it. We've pretty much covered everything in the carousel. I need to add a few items for the show a little later, but thank you for watching this one. Thank you, Cookbook Divas, for your lovely comments. Um, thank you as well to Joseph De La Cruz for following me. Appreciate that. Um, and I shall be back in just under an hour's time. And um, we'll go through some more kit uh, and some more demos. So until then, whatever you're doing, take care.